What's going on guys? Dustin with NC Bass TV back at it again with another video. Uh, something a little bit different today and that is I'm going to be doing a jig trailer comparison. I guess that'd be what it is. Be like a jig face off almost. But um, what I got is, is five of my favorite jig trailers on tied on jigs all the same way everything's the same except for you know the different trailers what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to be dropping them into the tank here and um seeing like uh the action on the fall the uh how they how they stand in like defense mode like you want a jig to stand like you want a jig trailer to stand up in defense mode and overall just comparing the five different uh brands that i have tied onto these jigs so Let's go ahead and check out what styles we have tied on, and uh, we'll get, we'll get straight into it. All right, guys. So first, right here, I have a Guggenbaits. I believe this this right here is a Guggenbaits. I think it's a, the Crack and Crawl. Um, the second one right here is a Bizbaits Cutter Crawl. This third one is a Raised Tail, the small trailer crawl. This is a Zoom Chunk. The bigger ones, like the normal size ones. And this right here, my friends, is a uh, one poured by the tackle shop that I talk about in my videos that help me out a lot. Um, this is one by Iron Mountain Tackle, hand poured by the, by those guys. So, um, without further ado, I'm gonna drop these bad boys into the tank. See, I got everything set up, lighting's nice in there, and uh, let's see what these let's see what these different trailers have to offer. All right, guys. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start out with the Guggenbaits Crack and Crawl right here. Let's go ahead and drop that in. The first thing that I'm noticing immediately is a really, really nice defense pose here. Now right, look at that, guys. And I do have the. Uh, I tell you what, I'm gonna unplug the filter. All right, I got the filter unplugged. You can still see it's still standing up pretty well. And watch them tails kick on the fall and everything. Obviously, I can't drop it too too far, but if you see when I pull it up, a lot of action on those uh, on those kickers. And uh, an awesome stand-up defense position. So, I'll be honest with you guys. I'm gonna give that Guggenbaits. That's an A for me, to be honest. That looks really, really nice. But I'm gonna put him over here in the corner, and we'll drop another one in. All right, guys. Next up, we have the the Cutter Crawl by Bizbait. And I mean, really nice action on those on those claws as well on that one. And a really nice defense position as well. But watch those those uh those those pincers cut through the water. They kind of like kind of swirl almost. It's a really really nice action on that fall as well. And super super aggressive defense position. Look at that. Really, really nice. And a nice ball as well with that one too. So that one, I'll give that one an A as well. That's pretty nice. All right, the third one on the list is the Rage Tail Crawl, the Trailer Crawl. It's a nice action on the fall as well with this one. First thing I'm noticing is not quite the well, now that defense position there looks pretty nice, but then the claws do fall down. I noticed that the claws are not floating on this one. But it does, I mean, it does have a nice fall, and when you pick it up, it does have a lot of kick to it. But those claws do not stand up. As you can see, they, they just fall down. They're not quite as the defense. So you see that they, they kind of flutter for a minute and then they'll they'll sink back down. But still great action 
on the swim, on the fall and when you swim it. All right, this is a pretty famous one. The, uh, the, third, the fourth one is the zoom chunk on the back. First thing that I'm noticing is not very much. They kick a little bit on the fall when you pick it up, but not much for a defense position. That jig is nice. By the way, these are all the same brand jig. And uh, they're catcher lures. I don't know if you ever heard of them. They're pretty good jigs. But uh, yeah, first thing I'm noticing is not much action on the kickers, which is not a bad thing necessarily. Um, in the winter time, you kind of want something a little bit more subtle. But um, and not much of a defense mechanism, or like not much of a defense stance as, as well with these as you see with the other ones. Last but not least, I have the one that I showed you guys from uh, it's made by Iron Mountain Tackle and an all white 3 8 ounce jig. So nice action on the fall. Let's see that again. A lot of kick on the fall, and the first thing I'm noticing is look at the stand up on that. That might be the best defense uh, position that I've seen, the best defense position that I've seen so far from one of these jigs. That thing, guys, that thing stands straight up. It's my first time seeing it in the water, so that's pretty sweet. He's you can see it's almost vertical, straight up and down with the pincher straight up in the air. I know what I'm gonna be throwing on the bed. I will be throwing this particular jig on a, on a bed. High visibility and that kind of a defense mechanism, that is going to get eight. I'm actually super surprised and super impressed by how that by how this one's done. This might be number one over the Guggen and the Biz Baits because those two are the best so far. But guys, look at that. Every time I do it, it doesn't matter stand straight up. Those pinchers are just straight up in the air. Right behind me, I have all five of the jigs with the trailers standing right beside each other for a good comparison right here towards the end of the video. So, unless you guys check it out, you guys tell me which one of these five performs the best in your opinion, and if there's another jig trailer that you that you prefer to use that I didn't use in this video, let me know in the comments below, and I'll rig them back up. I'll go buy that soft plastic and we'll rig them up in the tank, and I'll try them out, and we'll see where your best jig trailer but something tells me that you're not going to beat that right there. If you can beat that right there, I'll be surprised by any, uh, by any, any jig trailer made by like a bigger company. Uh, I'll be surprised. But like I said, guys, we got your Guggen over here, your Bisbaits Cutter Crawl over here, which the Guggen was stand up better. I think it might be laid down a little bit. But uh, your Guggen Baits, your Bisbaits, Raid's Tail, Zoom and the Iron Mountain Tackle. They're all standing up really, really well. The ones that had a good uh, defense mechanism. But I think the Rage Tail, I was super surprised about the Rage Tail not standing up too well. But and I knew the Zoom Chunk wasn't going to stand up that well. But 
the Raid Stealth of Rosme. I'm impressed by the Guggen's, the Biz Bait, and I'm super, super impressive on this Iron Mountain Tackle right here. So, that being said, guys, if you like this kind of video, be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button. Um, I, all the support means a ton to me. I'm at like 206 subscribers now. God bless y'all. Please hit that subscribe button. Turn on that bell notification. Let me know. That, that, that lets me know that you guys are super interested, and uh, that, that'll inform you every single time I upload a video. Uh, sorry for the lack of videos here lately. Been working a lot. Weather's been terrible. Just got the fish tank set up, so hopefully many more of these to come. But um. Like I said guys, thank you guys for all your support, God bless you, and uh, hit that subscribe button, we'll catch you on the next episode, God bless.